What exactly is the problem with your home? If you want to enjoy your marriage, then as a wife, you must be ready to do two things. I have brought to you and your husband a special clothes for your marriage journey. My darling wife, you are the perfect gift of God for my life. <laughs> Without you in my life, this world will have no meaning to me. No wonder you didn't allow me to have the password to your phone and you call yourself a church worker. I shall walk. Point of correction. I have neither a wife nor children. Okay? How I wish I was not married. Now, what responsible woman comes back home at this ungodly hour of the night? Excuse me, sir. You knew you were getting married to a career woman when you came to meet me. We can't afford to live together in the same house with a wicked and uncaring father like you. Are you stupid? <laughs> You called me a troublemaker, Keshi, and you have that trouble today. Look at him, you are running away from home. Mommy, what have you seen? Mm. You have not seen anything. Ah, we are used to it. Sonia, you will regret this. Jibola, you have finished me. You have finished me, uh, officer. Are you looking at me? Mm -hmm. Any amount, I'm ready to pay, please. My daughter must know that, please, I'm begging you, please. Alas, my sister, I determined to make my marriage work. You can't understand the pains I'm going through. That thing I call a wife. It's a full basket of trouble in my life. Mommy, Keshi is not appreciative. He complains of every little thing I do in the house. I assure you, you will pay dearly for all this, your wicked act. Mommy, tell me. Leave me alone! Upon which foundation is your home actually built? 